would you say if I told you the Texas oil boom that began in 1901 at Spindletop near Beaumont actually started as a result of a strange one-armed man's interest in baking better bricks? Well, Patillo Higgins of Sabine Pass, Texas grew up a troublemaker, which eventually led to him losing part of an arm after a shootout with a sheriff's deputy. Pew, pew! He worked in the timber business. <laughs> came to Jesus at a camp meeting, then started Higgins Manufacturing Company, a brickworks in Beaumont. Higgins became interested in using oil and gas as a reliable fuel for his kilns, so he traveled to Pennsylvania, the center of the oil industry in the late 1800s, to learn what he could. By 1892, he realized that the geology of the Texas Gulf Coast seemed perfect for oil. He also realized that there might just be a bit more money in oil than in bricks. For the next few years, despite several failed attempts at bringing in a well, Higgins kept believing there was oil under a mound by the name of Spindletop. And of course, he was right, more than right. Black gold changed Texas forever and changed Patillo's name to Prophet of Spindletop. Want more Texas history? Look us up the Texas Center at Shriner University.